Hello and welcome. I'm really glad you joined me today for it's going to be the hit class. What we're going to do today is going to do an hour and 30 minutes and I'm going to do it as an AMRAP. So I'm going to tell you how many of those exercises you do and you've got one minute 30 on each one before we move on to the next one. I will be using a set of weights today. I'm going to be using a set of fours and I'm going to go five on one of my single ones. Okay, so what you need is one set of weights. We're going to use enough room to move about in. Um, I will be using a mat just to kneel down on that, but otherwise I'm keeping it out of the way, and a bottle of water. So if you have all those things handy, so come down, I'll get ready to go, and we're gonna go in four, three, two, one. Okay, give me that little march through. Bringing the knees up, okay, up and over. Lovely, good, so again, I got that abs pulled in, rainbow with my arms, getting that knee lift. Yeah, I'm gonna do four more here. Already feel those abs are pulled in. Now I'm gonna kick out on one side. I'm gonna lift the arms up. Good, I'm gonna go the other side and give me that lift. Now I'm gonna change that to a knee up on this side. Little knee up and turn. Feel it through the waist. Core pulled in. Gonna change sides. Yeah, I've got another four here. Feel that little bit tightness on the abs. Now I'm going to do a step touch. Pulling back with those arms. I'm going to come up in the middle here. Reach it up for me. Rib cage, as I say, down and in the whole time. The abs are pulled in. Good, now the other way. Bring it in. Opening out those ankles. I'm going to do a step leg curl. Step leg curl. Yeah, feel those pecs, getting those arms together, pushing back with the elbows, hamstrings get that lift, single knee lift and turn. Lovely, good. Feel that through the waist, my knees are driving up. Yeah, go another four. And well done, give me a squat here and push. Back on your heels. Good, give me that push. Now, give me a little lift, like a sumo squat. Lovely, good. Feet just outside of hips. I'm going to do a leg lift on one side. A leg lift. Good, so get those turning the waist. Get feel those obliques pulling in, getting that knee to turn each time. Other side. Good, so just doing it slow so I can get that full movement round. Yeah, I've got four more. I'm going to do a drop forward from here so I push my hips back, straight legs, give me that drop. And then coming up all the way. And again. And coming up. Lovely, good. Little run in, run out. Little run in, run out. Good. Four, three, two, one. Lovely, good. Just give a little shake off. On my first one, I'm going to use my set of four kilogram weights. It's going to be single flies for four, up and up and up, and then I'm going to do a skate for four, and then I go again. So it's going to be a repetition of that, one minute, 30 seconds to go. Lovely, good. So grabbing those weights, we will start at five. Lovely, good. So I've got that lift. Feel it strong. Lovely, good. Skate. One, two, three. Feel that work in the upper back as well. Lovely, good. Give me that lift. Lovely, good. Here, little jump side to side. I sink into my squat. Don't let those weights roll over your lower back. Good, keep that nice straight lower back. So when I'm doing that jump sideways, 
I've got a nice straight back. Here we go. Good. Ready to go again. Give me that lift. Lift. Now the jump. Good. Up. 30 seconds left. You're doing good. Are we good here? Well done. So, an unwrap session. So, I'm just working all the way through that one minute 30. Push it down. Get that jump. I'm in my last few seconds now. Get me that lift. Lift each side. Lovely, good. And then the jump. Three, two, one. Good work. Well done. You can go upper weight on this one if you want to. It's going to be a tricep dip, drop, and that full lift like that there. Lovely, good. And then I'm going to do a jump out, a jump in. I'm just going to rock my hips, come back, jump out, jump in, little rock of the hips. Okay, are we ready to go? This time it's eight. Give me that tricep lift. Sip and hollow on. Rib cage down. Six. Seven. Eight. Lovely, good. The weight goes down. You're going to jump out for me. Jump out. Jump back in. Little rock of the hip forward. Then go back out again. Little rock of the hip forward. So I'm just trying to stay low. Three, four, five, six, seven, one more now, eight, lovely, good, I'm back down, I went to those triceps and here we go again, rib cage down and in, belly button pulled into spine, full lock, on those elbows. Two, one, good work, well done. Ready for my jump back. My jump back, really feel about that core the whole time. Good, one, just give me that little rock down. Two, three, four, five. Good work, well done. Back to my first one, my set of four kilogram weights, so what you perceive to be medium to medium heavy. I'm getting that lift and then I'm getting that skate jump. Lovely, good. So here, nice straight back, my shoulder blades pull back down and in. Never let you feel that those are gonna roll over. Okay, we have got still some seconds left here. So just getting in that good positioning. Okay, here we've got the lift. Lovely, good here. Let's go back to fours now. Lovely, good. And get me that lift. Lovely, good. That jump squat. Like a little skate, double skate. Good. Up. Elbows are always bent on this one. And I'm holding that weight at the front, so there's quite a lot of work to be done, not just through my core here, but again, my core is really helping me to get that bounce off the floor. Good. And give me that lift. Good, up here. Give me that lift. 30 seconds to go. time and it'll get you up and down elbow squats with that weight at the front yeah here we go last few seconds three two and one and good work well done you've got that 30 seconds rest 
And then we're going on to those tricep lifts again. And those jump out, jump in. And remember this time, it is eight of each. And then we're gonna be moving on into 12s, different exercise. Okay, lovely, good. Right, ready to go? Three, two, one, we're on. This time it's eight. Remember on that. Rib cage down and in, belly button pulled in. Five, all the way up, lock the elbow. Six, seven, eight, good work. Here, jump out, jump in. Little rock of the hips here. Keep that core strong each time. Lovely, that's five. Six. Really watch your jump out. Seven. Eight. Good work. Down again. Weight over your head. Give me that lift. Up for eight. Lock those elbows each time. That's what's going to get that tricep to work. I don't lean back. Got my sip and hollow on. Good. Two more to do. Two and one. Less than 30 seconds left. Let's do that jump out. Jump in. Give me that little rock. Two. And just got that done. Eight. Good work. Well done. We are moving on. I'm going to do... 12 now, with a little kick through, no weights, just my own body weight, and then I'm going to come forward and do shoulder taps, in an incline position or in a full brief position, so my first one, I'm here, I'm going to do kick through on each side, and I get that lift, really working my obliques on all of these, okay, are we ready to go, I get a little kick through, lovely good, one, Two, this is 12 now. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, that's it, good. 10, think about that core, 11, 12, lovely, good. Here or here, shoulder tap. Two, three, four, five, Six, that work on my core. Four more to do. Four, three, two, one. Lovely, good. Ready for those kickbacks again. Here we go. Coming up, I kick through. One, two, three, four. Get that bleak work. Five, six. Core pulled in the whole time. Seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, lovely good, incline or plank, feet just outside wide, core really pulled in here, 7, 8, 9, I'll get that, 10, done, okay lovely good, on my next one, we're going to be using that four weight again. 12 curtsies with a hook over my head. I'm going on one leg. I can do the other leg next time round. Then I'm going to do 12 elbow to knee here. That'll be good. So that leg coming across. My first one into that curtsy. Remember which leg you use, you use the other one the other time round. Okay, here we go. One. Two, three, four, five. I'll go for 12 again. Halfway, six. Lovely, good. Feel that work all the way over one side. Seven, eight, nine, ten. I've got two more now. Eleven. 
12, that'll be good. On this side, one, two, I'm up nice and tall, three, four, five, just bring that elbow together, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, good work, well done. Are we ready for that curtsy again? Again, so it's really working that one arm, that one leg to get me up and to keep me stable. Core always pulled in, my shoulders and my hips to the front. That's it, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, oh, eleven. Good work, well done. Break here, we're doing those kick throughs again. On my second set around, I've gone up to 12. Get me that kick through, then get me that lift. Okay, are we ready to go? Three, two, one, here we go. Kick through. And we're going for 12. Next circuit. 
Good work, well done. Take that little break, table break whenever you want it. On this one, I'm going back to eights again, and I've got the higher weight this time, and it's going to be eight snatch and lifts, drop, nice straight back, jump in, up, reverse curl, back up to my squat, get ready to start again. Remember it's about straight back, so that's in the hollow being on. Lovely good, eight, now I'm doing eight runners, and then I'm changing legs. Okay, are we ready to go? Zip and hollow is on, shoulder blades are back and down. Three, two, one, drop, jump up, lift, and go back on it, lovely, good. Here, jump up, lift. Now you can keep that arm up on that one, or you can have it down like I did on that first one. You can up, you can drop it again, and get into that lunge, lovely, good. Three. Keep all the way up. Four just increases that work. Lovely, good. Five. Three more to do for me. Six with that heavier weight, with that long lever. Seven. One more. Up. Get me that lift. Get me that lunge. And we're back down. Good. Okay. Eight rounds for me which is eight doubles. Okay, so I go one, just coming across two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good work, well done. I'm grabbing that weight again. Nice straight back. Jump up, give me that lift, or it can be on your shoulder on this one. That'll be good. That'll be good. Jump up, lift, and good work, well done. Okay, just get that little rest before we start that whole thing again. The snatch and lift, and then the runners. Okay, you have 15 left. This is my last circuit. I'm using that heavy weight, I'm coming back with the other leg. Okay, so I'm here, I do the snatch lift, jump, lift, lunge it back down, come back, the snatch lift, jump, up, and back down. Still working in the eights. Three. Four. Go core cool, really working for me here as well. Five. Keep that arm strong. Six. You can keep it on your shoulder, remember here. Seven. Eight. Lovely, good. The eight runners. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good work, well done. Second set. Here we go. I've got some seconds left. I'm in my snatch and lift, and that jump, give me that lift, go back on the lunge, come out wide, that'll be good, snatch and lift, up, snatch and lift, jump, lift, good work, well done, nice straight back, abs pulled in. Last few seconds. And well done. Good work. An all over body workout on that one. With my core helping me all the way through. Okay, I'm just going to do a little stretch out now on those last few minutes. Just going to come off that music. Lovely, good. So, just get me a little drop down on one side, then the other. Good, so again, just letting that heart rate come down. Good, get that drop, and get that drop. Good, and I'm gonna go forward with that stretch, a bit like where we started here. 
really stretching out those hamstrings and then coming up and then pushing my hips back to get it again and come up lovely good hands above your head I'm just gonna get that little stretch out so my knees are soft I'm gonna get that rib cage coming away from my waistband and then on the other side movement, getting that stretch up and out, lovely, good, I can stay here, I can hold on to something, because I'm going to do a glute stretch, I have to be on one leg, push my hips back first, then come down and hug my knee in across my chest, pushing those hips back the whole time. and then come up onto the other side crossing over just get your balance by holding on to something if you need to hold something all the way down you can but push your hips back first drop that center of gravity and let your chest come down to that crossed over leg lovely good really feel that glute stretch those power moves those jumps aided by your glutes the whole time lovely good then I'm coming up I'm just going to do a drop back into that heel pushing my heel in while I just soften that leg going forward lovely good and then I'm going to get a lift up with the arms as well so really feel that you're as straight as an arrow from your arms back down into your heels lovely good and then on the other side drop that head into the floor, head in line with your spine, arms in line with your head, just all reaching forward whilst pushing that heel into the floor, softening that front leg. Lovely, good. I'm going to come up again if you want to hold on to something, front to thigh stretch, hold on to your laces, do me the zip and the tip. Good, just keep over that one leg. And down, and then on the other side, coming up, holding onto the laces, down, give me that zip and tip. Lovely, good. I'm going to do a little swoosh down now, nice and loose with the arms, loose with the arms, but in with the core, drop down, come up, and reach up. Lovely, good. Really feel long in the spine on that one. Drop down, come up reach up and still getting that work through the glutes through the legs abs pulled in and one more and coming up lovely good I come forward I slightly concave by keeping my zip and hollow on I can feel that outer back stretch that lower back stretch and then I drop my head to increase that stretch out through the back of my spine Lovely, good. That upper back done a lot of work, especially on those first ones where we're doing the jumps with the weights. Okay, lovely, coming back up, dropping down with your hands in front of you. Take a deep breath in. And now, pushing out and down and letting that air be pushed out by the rib cage, by the abs, by the belly button going into the spine, all coming back down to the very bottom. Lovely, good. Give me a little shake out and very well done. So again, just using those weights, doing those weights aerobically as well. Core central to all of this. So I hope you enjoyed that. I enjoyed teaching it to you and I will see you again next time. Any comments, please do leave them. I always like to know what you feel about most of these exercises. Okay, bye-bye for now. I'll see you again next time.